Hello, welcome back to RimWorld. You know, I'm pretty sure in the previous episode I mentioned that food stores were looking really solid. Uh, they're suddenly not looking really solid. So let's forget turning this into Devil Strand and turn it back into food. Uh, this can be rice. Might also replace these cactuses with potatoes as well. Um, the cactuses were cool, but they're not as efficient as anything else, I don't think. You can also hunt down the random animals walking around the colony too. There's this thing that's just... <laughs> it's just in the new pen, which is kind of funny, but... Uh, we'll get that hunted. Anyway, what's the plan today? Do we have any quests we could do? Let's see. Uh, the excavation. You've learned of an ancient complex nearby. Oh, well, I guess we could do this then. That's good. Uh, and this too. Oh, this requires three colonists to get sent away. Also, not too bad. Alright, two more things I could do then, quest-wise. Uh, we are in a nice stable position, though. I'm tempted to let basic constructions get finished off. And then spend some time just taking genes out of people and putting genes into people, because... I could probably put together something in each, well, most of our thralls that contains very happy and dead calm. So that might be... Might be a good plan for today. So, you have all your genes. <laughs> Not all of your limbs, though. So we'll start by putting you in the gene extractor. Uh, and let's see, who's a baseliner? Because I know that's safe to play around with. Okay, Garrison. We'll make a gene pack for Garrison. So let's see, what can we do easily? Garrison, what do you do job-wise, first of all? Uh, you don't do animals, that's fine. I think that's the only weird one that we have. So dead calm and very happy. And to cancel that out, awful animals, poor social. Six of six complexity. Alright, pretty straightforward. Um, I could give you strong construction and pig ears. Which wouldn't be the worst idea, right? Because you do actually do a lot of construction. But that would require the next building, which I can build now because we have a bunch of steel. We've got 900 steel at the moment. But I think it's the gene processor. Increases the maximum genetic complexity. All right, let's um, we'll stick this in here as well then. It's fine there, isn't it? They don't actually need to access these things, do they? So, okay. We'll see if we can give uh, ostrich revenge. Who's shooting that one? Kuzpai? Easy stuff. Uh, I'll see if I can give uh, Garrison good construction as well and see what difference that makes. I mean, I guess that's just going to put him on 20 right away then, which is kind of cool. Alright, that's the plan for today then. Lots of gene stuff. While some... Uh... Oh hey, the two cats are synchronized. I like when cats do that. Uh, we'll do gene stuff and then, yeah, if we need something to do, we've got some missions to do on the map as well. Uh, and hopefully, you know, <laughs> food stabilizes again. But uh, that's it for the intro, so I'll speed up time now and see what happens today. Uh, Manhunter pack, okay. Manhunting mower. Okay, that's a lot of them. All right. Uh, okay, first things first then. <laughs> Get inside the zone quickly. Inside the new and improved inside zone, which should be everything now. Uh, almost everything. Good enough. Uh, let's also go ahead and close this door until I'm ready. In fact, yeah, you're going through that door, that's fine. Pretty intimidating sounds. Alright, looks like we are safely in though. Also, let's make these uh, uniform. Very nice. Uh, so these guys are gonna menace just outside our entrance. Fair enough. Alright, the inside zone is actually in everything now. 
let the guys just uh, catch up on a few more tasks. Maybe even build these shelves. And then uh, <laughs> I'll put some weapons on them. Maybe we can go and kill these things. It is a lot of them though. They look pretty vicious. Hmm. <laughs> we'll see. Oh. Okay, we've scanned some steel. Let's see what this is. Alright, still not very close. Also, can't get now, but um, yeah, that's good. We're finding some stuff underground. So we got uranium, uranium, steel, silver, and more steel over here. Yeah, I mean, our colony, covers a, our colony covers a lot of space, so it's likely we'll find steel nearby at some point. As long as the guys just keep working it. I don't have a research project at the moment, so... Oh, this has been built too. Um, do I really want to mess with these things? I mean, I could probably open this door and pull them into a corridor and then just need one blocker. Or even put one blocker either side with... Oh no, I shouldn't have a crossfire, should I? That would be bad. Um... I suppose we don't need to go outside just yet, so it's not like it's a huge deal. I could just let them just sit out there while we concentrate on interior jobs. Because we do have stuff to be getting on with. Let's see, I can do eight complexity now. So if I did very happy, dead calm, poor social, awful animals, strong construction, and cold weakness. Oh, that's too complex, damn. I guess strong construction is... Two complexity, or maybe pig ears is one? No. Oh, well, um, hmm, let's see. Pig ears is... No, okay. I guess strong com construction is two, yeah. That's a shame. Yeah, very happy is three, which is a big one. I guess positives are very complex. Um, okay, well, let's just slap this into Garrison. It's not like he needs the extra construction skill that much anyway. Sure, why not? We'll make that. Uh, and meanwhile, Sean is still being extracted from. Wait, was that no food? No food, no sleep. Okay, well. <laughs> Next time I'll wait, uncheck people's moods before I put them into the extractor. But yeah, we'll keep going. Oh, nice. We have a war merchant. Maybe these guys can fight the mower. Uh, best of luck to them. They do not look <laughs> very tough. I think there's like five people there. They do have a cougar and some panthers, though. Alright, well, good luck against the mower. Please don't leave my doors open if you walk in. I know there's more people there than I thought. You got any weapons? Random priv primitive weapons? Well, this will be an in interesting confrontation, won't it? I haven't noticed them so far, though. Oh, spoke too soon. Here we go. Hmm, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> yeah, those mower are pretty vicious, huh? <laughs> That's the end of the caravan. <laughs> uh, hmm. It's a shame no one's just wounded, or we could try and imprison them, I suppose. Alright, gene extraction complete. That's a lot of stuff. Pollution stimulus, unattractive, wake up imp impervious. Very interesting. Okay, and Hex has made the gene pack. So, Garrison, uh, please come and insert this into yourself. Looks good. Alright, next for extraction, we'll do lemming then. Uh, your needs are fine. Maybe you can get a meal first. Can I do that? Can I force? No. Wait. Can I make you eat? No. Okay, well... <laughs> let's get a lemming to come and get gene extracted. Uh, next person would be destroy hats. You... you do do animals though. Okay, so what does that mean for us? Let's see. Can't use awful animals. Can you poor social dead calm? Very happy. Uh, cold weakness. I wonder what dead calm and aggressive does. Looks like nothing, because nothing changes when I add it. So I guess they just can't be stacked. 
Makes sense. This is minus five efficiency, so pollution stimulus. So that's a negative? Unattractive. Wake up impervious. Oh no, that's a that's a bad one. Okay, I see. Yeah, yeah. Bonus is yeah, positive is positive is good, <laughs> negative is bad. That's easy to remember. Okay. So I don't think there's an easy way for me to do this. There's slow wound healing. That doesn't seem like a great one to add in, but I mean it gets you very happy and dead calm. And makes you eat less food. I can change the icon, interesting. Uh, that's fine though. Alright, we'll stick that into destroy hats. <laughs> How's it going, Moe? you alright? Nope. Looking good. These guys managed to kill one of them. Yeah, these things seem pretty vicious, huh? Alright, Xenogym has been, been completed. This was for destroy hats. Alright. Go do that. I need to remember then, you have slow wound healing. You're also blind, which is great. That's <laughs> going to be a great combination of traits. So we get out of this one. Uh, fire spew. All right. Bit of an odd one, but okay. Schmaltz, the Neanderthal. You can go and head into the machine next. How are you doing, Vasco? Are you getting all your needs with... He's in school with Ramp. Uh, Ramp explained how to counter a sword to Vasco. <laughs> I guess he's still building melee skill. Interesting. Okay, a few more of these guys are bleeding to death. That's nice. Oh, is that going to block the uh, interaction spot? Let me just check. Can I force... Oh, are there any tasks to do here? Okay, I think it's probably fine then. Alright, Nosto next. Nosto also really does animals, so... I feel like I probably shouldn't stick slow wheel wound healing into everyone, though. Maybe I should wait with the animal guys until I get a better negative gene. Uh, which might come soon. Let's see what we get out of Schmaltz before I continue. Oh, interesting. Heat tolerant and slow study. Oh, that's not a penalty to reset to um, intellectual. It's a penalty to learning everything. Okay, that also seems like a pretty bad one. I thought that was going to be poor intellectual, but oh well. <laughs> Close. Uh, Kashi, you can get in next. Have we run out of um, gene bank space or something? Let's see. Four, four, three, four, zero, zero, zero. No, we've got plenty of space. Uh, can I make you prioritize banking? Yeah, bank those. We'll do Kashi next. Uh, Schmaltz is extremely unhappy due to psycho addiction. Do I have something I could do about that? I don't think we have anything to do with psycho, unfortunately. We have wake up impervious, but um, what what is your right, Neanderthal? What can I? I'd like to test what happens if I put. No, because this is germline and this is xenogene, so I think we can slap xenogenes onto this without affecting it. So what do you do? Construction, cooking, crafting. You already have poor shooting, poor social, poor intellectual. But I could stick poor animals on this. He has aggressive. I wonder what happens if we try to put dead calm on that and flip cold tolerant to... All right, let's just play around. Okay. If I try to put these on you with awful animals and cold weakness? And what else could we do that would... don't really want to do slow wound healing. It's the only option I really have though, isn't it? Let's see what happens if I try to put that on Schmaltz though. I can see what happens. He's constantly trying to drink Psychite tea, which I don't want. Um, <laughs> what can I do about this? I think I have to just imprison him, right? Want to break his addiction? Hmm. Alright, let's just do that then. 
we'll do that till he's uh, snapped out of it. But if I if I put dead calm into him, he should not try to like bust out of prison at least. Uh, Ramp needs death rest. Okay, we'll take care of that. Looks like the mowers have calmed down. Maybe. Nope, they still are manhunters. Death in three point two days though. Cool. Okay, Kashi, we extracted slow wound healing again. Linked to deep red skin. Um, what do we currently have? Is it slow wound healing on its own? Yeah. That's probably strictly worse, right? I can just not... Let's not put that in the gene bank then. It's kind of redundant. Uh, and I think that's it for all of our special cases, unless we want to start extracting... And the vampires. Oh, there's also Sino. Why not? We'll stick Sino in the gene extractor as well. Uh, let's see what else we get from him. Alright, looks like the mowers have gone, so that's... Um, <laughs> we got one of the corpses too, that's nice. Uh, okay, anything here we want to salvage then? Emekin, I guess. Corpses, sure. Uh, one more mower corpse. Looks like that's everything, though. Alright guys, go, uh, go pull skulls out of corpses and stuff. Okay, so let's put this Xenogem into Schmaltz and see what happens. Berserk, Schmaltz. Man, bad timing. We're about to put dead commons here. <laughs> Prevent this from happening. Uh, let's draft everyone, except maybe Hexaflex. I don't know, I feel like that's a bad idea. Does Berserk smash doors? Yes. Okay. He can't put up that much of a fight though, right? I mean, he's got two peg legs, stab score in his head, <laughs> gene loss shock. <laughs> he's going through psychotic withdrawal. I mean, I know he's a tough bastard because he's a Neanderthal, but... I mean, really. I mean, you guys should have this, right? I don't really want to send Hexaflex over, but I will if I have to. Garrison can't walk, Destroy Hats can't walk, okay. Uh, anyone else nearby? Dela Cruz. Get over here too. Okay. <laughs> Pretty slow. Alright guys, beat him down. Alright, good work everyone. <laughs> we now need an emergency uh, door repair so that things can go back to normal. Dela Cruz, did you lose a limb? Uh, you lost an ear! That's a new one. Okay. Uh, constructors are... Garrison Kiwi and Kashi. Kiwi, can you urgently repair this door? Thanks. Ooh, that's a cool one. Elongated fingers we just extracted. So I think that's just better manipulation. Yeah. So that would also be nice to just put into everyone, but let's we'll see what we can get away with. See what happens to Schmaltz. Uh, right. So. You are now a Neanderthal, but you have dead calm. Which, okay, yeah, this is now greyed out, so that, that overwrites aggressive, which is cool. You're also now weak to cold instead of cold tolerant. But you're very happy. So there we go. Alright, this is cool. <laughs> uh, we'll keep going. Oh, Cusepa needs death rest. Okay. Not a problem. Damn, I think it would be possible to slap elongated fingers on the Xenogerm that Garrison has, which would help out because he does construction. Uh, I guess we could just remake it though, right? So let me just, <laughs> let's just double check. He has, yeah, very happy in Day Calming. He has cold weakness, awful animals, poor social. Okay, very happy. 
Awful animals, poor social, poor weakest, elongated fingers. Yeah. Alright, you get a new Xenogerm garrison. <laughs> I think you can give that to most people as well. Telecruise does do crafting apparently, so yeah, I guess that would help with planting those as well though. Same for Cali. Yeah, this might be a pretty good one actually. Right, Garrison, you can... <laughs> okay, yeah, so Xenogems overwrite, but if it's a, a normal one, they... What's the other term? Germline? And it's fine. Okay, I get it. So it'll still just be 100% metabolism, but he now also has elongated fingers. Yeah, I'll put that same gene pack into Delacruz and Kali then as well. Don't think there's any reason not to. So almost all of our colonists, well, almost all of our thralls have dead calm then. Just need Sean, Lemming, Kashi. But uh, yeah, that'll be it. And also Schmaltz once he's over his uh, psycho addiction. I'll try and break that. Visitor. Welcome. Alright, three more Xenogems are ready with the uh, the usual stuff. We'll get those into uh, Delacruz, Kali, and... Who's the other one going into again? Delacruz, Kali, and Garrison, right. Oh yeah, we're overwriting him for his long fingers. Okay. Uh, I wonder why that's not being prioritized. Maybe because we don't have a doctor at the moment. That could be why. Let's... <laughs> I always forget to put people back on doctoring after I've had Coosboy do something. You can help out too, Rank. We'll get that done, and then, uh, yeah. If nothing else happens, I'll start doing some quests then. Things are pretty stable. Oh, hey! I want us to gather in to celebrate Coosboy and Kiwi Satan's marriage. Uh, congratulations. Where's everyone else? <laughs> They're all <laughs> recovering in the hospital, I think. <laughs> Uh, Kiwi, you want to get in position? Alright, just the important people here, that's okay. <laughs> What's Ramk up to? Oh, he's officiating, okay. Looks like a great wedding. It's not where I expected people to stand during the wedding, but okay. Uh, congratulations. Hexaflex talked about devils with Vasco. <laughs> Alright, well at least they're all hanging out. I remember when colonists used to have weddings, people would just immediately run away when it said that they were celebrating. Alright, there we go. Uh, congratulations to Kuzpa and Kiwi. Alright, I think it would be nice if they spent their honeymoon tackling an ancient structure. So I'll, sp I'll send Kuzpa, Kiwi and Ramk off to... Uh, Find some information about our next relic. Should be fun. I mean, th these guys are, have great moods now. Um, Kuzbai could do do with a meal, but it said they're going to get fed en route, so... Best of luck to them. Let's, uh, let's see how far they have to go. Pretty far. See how this goes. Uh, so, you know, why are you, like, so ill? Okay, genes regrowing, blood loss extreme. Yeah, I keep having to, like, um, do hemogen extraction on people because we don't have a good source of blood still. I might be a bit too aggressive about it, I don't know. <laughs> Just everyone is lying in a hospital bed currently because of blood loss, I think. Alright, let's clear this thing out. This there might be unknown threats, but that's par for the course for uh, ancient structures, I think. Also, I turned off the mod that increased the uh, value of the rewards, so let's remind ourselves exactly how bad rewards usually are. <laughs> let's see. Also, why even bother using the doors? Let's just blow through a wall. Probably works out better for us in the long run. Really need to make Kiwi some legs. Uh, that should probably be the next thing I use my materials for, since we still have steel in the bank. Okay, there's terminal number one.
Okay, one little shitter, not too bad. Uh, Kiwi should be able to do with that pretty easily. And who's got the best research skill? 13 and 7. Ramp gear up. Right, terminal 1 is down. Okay. Check out the emetic crate. Six of medicine now, that's more like it. Alright, final terminal. That's pretty straightforward as well so far. We'll see what's in here though. Oh, I can hear a bomb, but I can't see it. Okay, it's in this room. That's okay then. Damn, that's pretty bad. Actually, you know what? Let's just ignore that room. <laughs> I don't want the ghost freaking out from fire, to be honest. <laughs> oh god. Uh, let's see if we can do this room instead. This is all steel wall. It's not great. Another hermetic crate, though. Oh, another bomb. Yeah, don't risk it. <laughs> Just get away. I'm sure whatever is in there is probably not worth it anyway. Fleeing fire, Kuzbai? Are you kidding me? I guess you can technically see this fire because it's just like one long bit of unbroken line of sight. God damn him. I think this is still on fire, but just in case, I might as well check this one out as well. Uh, raid does both them. Is that here or yeah? All right, it's only two people. I mean, maybe we can catch them. I'm not sure we can get them on the. Wait, have you hacked that? Already hacked. All right, are we done then? Is this done? <laughs> I didn't notice the message in the top. Yeah, that's this one. Does it say if it's done or not? Okay, let me check the messages then. I can't tell if this has been done or not. Let's see. Already hacked. Already hacked. Already hacked. I'll check the other rooms, but I think that's it then. First up, let's uh, go and meet these guys. Actually, let's first of all shoot through this wall. And then go and meet those guys. Okay. We have a supply satellite and another hermetic crate. Why not? Uh, more medicine, okay. And what do we get in the pods? 206 boil berries, okay. Since we have to get on a shuttle, I don't think we can pick up all those boil berries, unfortunately. I'm not even sure if we can capture a dude, but I guess I'll try. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> we'll just get out of here. Uh, where is the shuttle? There it is. Alright, great mission everyone. Alright, quest complete. Crisis of Bleach Schmaltz, oh no. Uh, how's your psycho addiction going? Withdrawal 26. Yeah, you'll get there. Okay, next thing to get started on is... Do we have tons of bricks still? Oh yeah, we're on the thousand for both of them. Miners must be working flat out. I mean, that's a ton of boulders we have right next to us now. Okay, great. So. Start building more walls. Alright, there we go then. Next few main walls. That should keep our constructors busy for 
a while. Yeah, we have plenty of bricks and plenty of stones at the moment, so... They might get it done pretty rapidly, depending. Uh, scan underground steel, anywhere nearby? Still not really very close. It would be nice to find steel somewhere that we don't need to run a bunch of power lines. We'll see though. Uh, and a real tribute collector. I don't suppose you sell slaves, do you? No? <laughs> okay. So what is it get raided by human beings? Uh, that reminds me, what was I going to do? Oh yeah, legs. Kiwi. Alright, you need a left leg. Can we just make, like, a bionic leg or at least uh, a prosthetic leg? Did I... Do we have bionics? I think that would be the advanced fabrication bench, wouldn't it? Uh, let's see. Bionics, bionics, bionics. Bionic replacements, yeah, fabrication. But I can at least do prosthetic legs. It's not much steel, but it is a lot of components. We don't have a ton of components still. 67. Now yeah, we can make a few prosthetics though, can't we? Exa needs the arm. Do we have someone who's like good at doctoring yet? Nostos up to 13. I could try giving cues by the arm with 13 medical, I suppose. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> Missing left arm. Uh, install bionic arm, left shoulder. We'll make sure it's Nosto doing this one. Uh, yeah, do you have an excellent bed at least? Nope. Alright, let's put you on... Put you on Glitter World Medicine. So you need rest. Uh, can anyone walk? <laughs> no, I can walk. Alright, the room must be clean. I can't right click it anyway. Okay. And Doctor's going to be Nosto. Who is... Why do you have no food? Oh, this hasn't been loaded. Okay. Uh... Please move some of that to the slime dispenser. Actually, do you know what, Nosto? Just go and eat a... Consume a simple meal, and then go do the surgery. We'll see how it goes. Oh, still haven't done Nosto's genotype. Yeah, because she does animals, that's right. You nice to have, uh, give her the elongated fingers. Alright, Kuspo's got the bionic arm. So he should be amazing at doing medical procedures now, since he's actually got both arms and he's our best medic. But, uh, yeah, I'll try to make a couple of legs then. Let's make six legs. Who is actually missing body parts still? Uh, Hex needs an eye. Kimi needs the leg. Ramp's okay, Sino's okay. Sean is just a disaster. I mean, sure, I'll try and get some arms made as well. Uh, Lemming, you're fine. Kashi, fine-ish. Garrison, yeah, missing an arm and a lung. Can't do much about the lung. Uh, Nosto needs a leg? Where, where's the tibia again? Uh, moving 40%. Yeah, that's a leg. Uh, Delacruz. Oh, Kali needs a jaw. I don't think we can do anything about that though, can we? There's like a wooden jaw or something? Yeah, install denture. Hmm. Alright, install denture then. Uh, Vasco, in one piece. Uh, learning well. He wants to chat with people over the radio. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Uh, currently harvesting corn. Nice work. Okay, we have a bulk goods trader, brackets, refugees. They are known as Furious Shipping. They are a bulk goods trader specialized on refugees. <laughs> what? <laughs> does that mean they sell slaves or what, what does that mean? Let's go find out. Also, Sean, clean the room when you finish eating, because it's pretty bad at the moment. 
Uh, Delacruz too. Okay, I can sell... I can sell our colonists or I can buy people. This is a child that's probably not very useful to us. No. Or maybe I just can't see their traits because of the mod. That's pretty funny. Let's see. Okay, you're unwaveringly loyal. How does that work if I buy an unwaveringly loyal colonist? That's kind of odd. I'm worried that's going to be bugged if I try it now. Uh, I can't see what their traits are anyway. Oh, they have tons of components though. Damn, it, right, let me just check if there's anything I can sell. I could sell the legendary duster just for money, which might be worth it, to be honest. Okay, I'll try buying these two people and see what, like, how it works, if they're unwaveringly loyal, if I've bought them or not. It seems kind of odd. Uh, but yeah, I am going to need to sell something that I don't particularly want to sell. Probably just the legendary duster, though. Um, no one's even wearing it. I think they're all prefer preferring to wear, um, like, just normal Devil Strand stuff over this. So fair enough. That puts us up 550. Uh, and then I can probably buy some components as well. Yeah, not quite all of them, but... Alright. Buy every were, but let's just see what we get. Just buying some human beings. Okay, you're not unwavering. I can see your traits as well. Okay, you are a perfect slave. <laughs> and Don. Oh, interesting. Vampire candidate, incapable of violence. Uh, communal. Don has grown accustomed to a tight -knit, tightly, tightly knit colony and loves sleeping in barracks, preferably with many other pawns. Well, that's going to be a weird one. Uh, and Zix is a kind teetotaler, <laughs> trigger happy. Uh, to be instantly enslaved. You guys also need our ID Legion. Uh, okay. Well, welcome to the colony. Come over here for a second. Uh, you're going to get to sleep in a nice communal barracks for a while. Alright, let's arrest Zix. And arrest Dawn as well. Fantastic. <laughs> And for now, do you know what? I'm just going to put you all on Hemogen Farm for the time being. Because we are just always out of blood. So that would be nice to start uh, fixing that. And I can put Dead Calm in you while you're in the prison, so that you won't, uh, <laughs> you won't smash out of the prison. Fantastic. Uh, anyway, I'll leave things there. Colony's coming along. Yeah, we just desperately need more people to get, start joining out. Uh, I don't really want to fight with these guys. <laughs> We're supposed to be doing the Empire stuff. We still have one more quest available that we can go and do. And uh, still a few more... Just a little bit more gene stuff to get done as well, but... Uh, yeah, things taking along. Ritual opportunity soon. Slave unsuppressed. And Kelly's in a hospital bed currently, so... Oh right, currently getting the jaw fitted. Oh, I guess because there's no like skull spikes or anything in this room. Uh, surgery failed. Well, there's a <laughs> there's a shock. <laughs> Sean, how dare you? <laughs> Kiwi's not going to discipline you. <laughs> All right. Anyway, yeah, I'll leave things there. But um, yeah, thanks always for watching. Hope you're enjoying it, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.